Let me ask you this, Ms. Johnson. She's sharing her life stories and uh, what hard work really means. And, um, you know, some of, what were some of your most valuable lessons you learned throughout your, your life? Be patient with yourself. Mm, I'm learning that now. Yeah, it's hard. <laughs> you know, because you want, you want your dreams to come true overnight. Mm -hmm. And so it's, it, it, it doesn't happen like that. Mm -hmm. And I had to learn that the hard way is to not try to jump ahead, be patient, plan, be courageous. Because there are a lot of people when you're on the road to success that will doubt you and will try to say things to distract you from your goal. Mm -hmm. um, and so you have to be bold mm -hmm. and, and fierce. Right. You know, my grandmother said, a quiet mouth doesn't get fed. And so you really do have to speak up and say what you want, believe it, have faith that it's going to happen, and go after it. Right. Right. How did you overcome struggles? And I'm going to ask you a few questions, so I know you have to go. How did you overcome struggles? God. Mm. Mm. That's really what it was. I mean, God. Because I look back, my daughter is 21 now, and she's in college. Mm -hmm. um, when I was 21, I had a four-year-old giving me five. And so I think, how did how did I how did I handle that? Yeah. How did you do it? I mean, throughout college. Did you take your baby with you? Yes, I mean, absolutely. She's been with me. Who helped you in the midst of all that? Like, well, you know, um, when I got there in the beginning, I was by myself because I didn't know anyone and I had moved away from. I bet they thought you were crazy. <laughs> My this family woman did. is crazy. My family did. They were. They were. They were. They were trying to tell me you need to get a job. You need and to and abortion get... never crossed your mind. It did for a moment, but my family was so religious. Yeah, and they would curse you. Oh my goodness, my grandfather. Maybe you gonna go on and have that baby. Go on the baby. No, yeah. So, um, but it was it was it was God. I took my daughter to college, and I believed that everything was gonna be okay. I prayed every night, and things would just start happening to me. You know, once.